Hello children, welcome back to the digital lesson. I hope all are doing well. You might have eagerly waiting for the new lesson. Yes children, today we will start with a new lesson, new concept. Today's topic is how long is this? At the end of the session, you will learn identifies meter and centimeter length measuring length in centimeters by using scale relates meter with centimeter converts meter into centimeter measures length in meters centimeters and inches estimate length of an object and distance between two given locations solves problem involving length and distances in meters and centimeters children look at the screen can you identify the object on the screen yes children it's a scale let's understand about the scale this is the scale have you looked at the scale what are the dimensions on the scale how many centimeters is marked on the scale you saw see the children these are the centimeters and these are the inches on the scale one side is centimeters and the another side is inches. Children, on the scale, you will find centimeters. See, these are the centimeters 1, 2, 3, 4, till 30 centimeters are identified on the scale, and the inches. This side, you will find the inches. See, these are the inches. Here, 30 centimeters and inches are 12 inches. What is the length of an object drawn below and observe it? See the children, look at the screen. These are some objects are there. We have to find out the length of these objects. This is a scale, this is a dice and this is a matchstick. We have to find out the lengths of these three objects. Let us see how to measure these lengths. Length of the pencil starts from 1 centimeter to 6 centimeter that means pencil length is 5 centimeters length of the pencil we have to find out the length of the pencil see it starts from 1 centimeter to 6 centimeters total how many centimeters we will find see from here to here 1 2 3 4 5 total 5 centimeter see from 6 number to 1, 6 centimeters to 1 centimeter. See, 6 minus 1, you will get the 5 centimeter. The length of the pencil is 5 centimeters. Now, we will find out the length of a dice. See, children, dice is very small, no? We will play with the dice. See, it starts from 8 centimeters to 9 centimeters. Okay, children, see it is only 1 centimeter. So, the length of a dice is 1 centimeter, 9 minus 8, 1 centimeter. Children will now we will find out the length of a matchstick. Length of the matchstick starts from see 12 centimeters to 15 centimeters. See how many centimeters is this? See, we will find out 12 to 13 1 2 3 so length of a matchstick is 3 centimeters 15 minus 12 see 15 minus 12 you will get 3 the length of the matchstick is 3 centimeters children measure the objects again one this is another object this is dice this is matchstick and pencil three are in different length. So, we will find out the pencil is the pencil length is see we will start from here 0 we will finding the length of an object from 0 the starting point is 0 0 to 5. So, the pencil length is 5 centimeters match stick starts from also 0 to 3 it means the match stick length is 3 centimeters and dies 0 to 1 only 1 centimeter is the length of a dice children 
what is this? This is an ant and likes to eat sweets. Yes, children? Yes. So, ant is finding its food. So, help the ant to find out the shortest route. See, these are the routes to get the food for ant. See, this is a one route, this is another route, this one is, this is a route and this one is the another route. So, which is the shortest length by seeing you can understand the shortest distance between ant and the food. This is the shortest length of the sea. The middle one, the straight line shows the shortest length of the route. Children, so far you have learned to measure and estimate the lengths of an object centimeter with a scale. On the screen, you will find out centimeters and inches on the scale. Here, centimeter and this is the inches. Okay, children? Is the inches bigger than 1 centimeter? See the distance, children. Here to here, 1 centimeter to this inches bigger than 1 centimeter? Yes, children. You are right. Inch is bigger than 1 centimeter. Children, see the screen. In the image below, there are lengths or measured in centimeters. These objects are measured in centimeters. What is the length when measured in inches? Now only we learned about the inches, no? It is bigger than the centimeter. So, with that only we will find out the lengths of objects in inches. Children, we will measure the objects again. Measure the objects given below in inches. So, the objects are here, pencil, matchstick and dice. These are the lengths in centimeters. Pencil length is 5 centimeter, matchstick length is 3 centimeters and dice length is 1 centimeter. We have to find out these lengths in inches. So, now only we will learn about the inches. Pencil length is here 5 centimeter. If you calculate in inches, it is nearly 2 inches. So, what about the matchstick? Matchstick length is 3 centimeters, means it is more than 1 inch. Okay? And what about the dice? Dice length is 1 centimeter, means it is less than 1 inch. Yes, children, it is less than 1 inch. Children, see the screen. The things are given on the screen. You have to find out the length of these objects approximately. Chalk piece, pencil, math book, rupee stand note, bag and cell phone, television, brush, table, length and shoes. You have to find out these lengths in inches. Children, do you know all these things? Yes, children, this is a razor. This is sharpener, this is a pencil. We will measure these, uh, we can able to measure this in centimeters and inches. Till now, we learn about the centimeters and inches. What about these? Can we measure these in centimeters and inches? Yes, we can, but it is, these are bigger. The length is, it is very long. So, we have to find out the length of these objects. So, children, you might have went to the tailor shop. Children, look at the picture. See, the tailor is here, tailor and the girl. The girl is asking, how much cloth is this? Tailor said, this is 3 meters. Okay. Then, girl asked, how much is required for my kurta? Tailor said, 2 meters will be enough to stitch a Kurta. So, if you want to measure a bigger length, we have to measure in meters. The standard measure of a length is called meter. We use tape to measure meter length. Children, 1 meter equal to 100 centimeter. 1 meter equal to 100 centimeters. If you want to measure a bigger length, we use measuring tape. 
see this is the measuring tape, this is scale. We can also measure by scale also and this is another one which we can measure with the which we can measure the lengths. Children till now we will learn about the meter. So, 1 meter equals to 100 centimeters. Then half a meter means half meter equal to 50, 100 if you make it 2 it is 50 centimeters and uh, quarter meter, quarter meter means we are making it 4 parts and quarter meter equal to 25 centimeters. Children see the screen, observe the given measures and convert meters to centimeters. Till now we learn about centimeters, inches and meters now, here we are converting the uh, meters to centimeters. Okay. Length of a rope is here given 8 meters. So, we have to convert into centimeters. 1 meter equal to 100 centimeters, then 8 meter equal to, yes children, 8 meter equal to 800 centimeters. Good children. Next, length of a ribbon, length of a ribbon is 5 meters. So, what is the length of a ribbon in centimeters? See, 1 meter equal to 100 meters, then 5 meter equal to 500 centimeters. Now, we will find out the length of a wire. The wire length is 9 meters given here. So, 1 meter equal to 100 centimeters. So, 9 meter equals to 900 centimeters. We will go to the next one. Children see, we will find out the length of a pipe. Length of a pipe is given 11 meters. So, if we convert it into centimeters, 1 meter equal to 100 meters and 5 meter equal to 500 meters, then 11 meter equal to 1100 meters. The pipe length is 1100 centimeters. The length of a cloth is given here 7 meters. Length of a cloth is 7 meters. If we convert it into centimeters, 1 meter equals to 100 centimeters, then 7 meters equals to 700 centimeters. Good children. Now, we will find out the distances. Observe the pictures children. These are, this is a library where books are stored. Okay, children. This is a school. Very much. This is Vinay's house and this is a post office. The lengths are given, the distance is given in meters or we can write in short form m. So, the distance between library to school is 56 meters and the distance between school to Vinay's house 110 meters and the distance between Vinay's house and post office is 45 meters. The distance between post office and school 80 meters. The distance between post office and library is too long. Yes children, it is 225 meters. So, we will answer these questions children. So, what is the distance between Vinay's house and the school? Where is the Vinay's house? See, here Vinay's house and the school. See, find out the distance. See here, they mention 110 meters. Yes children, the distance between Vinay's house and the school is 110 meters. Next children. What is the distance between the school and post office? See, this is the school, this is the post office. So, the distance between school and the post office is 80 meters. The distance between the school and the post office is 80 meters. And the, what is the distance between library and the post office? Where is the library? See, library is here. So, the distance between library and post office. From here, you have to find out the distance till here. So, the distance between library and post office is 225 meters. Good children. Children, next, what is the distance between Vinay's house and the post office? There is a post office children here. The post office is here and the Vinay's house here. The distance between Vinay's house and the post office is 45 meters. Good children. Children, till now we find out the distance between some locations. Okay. 
children here see the screen the details are given below the details of the long jump competitions held at the school are as follows answer the following questions these are the students names distance the distance they jumped are given below so observe these lens and give answers here student name kamala jumped 1 meter 15 centimeters and ravi jumped 2 meters 18 centimeters and kishor jumped 1 meter 62 centimeters bindu jumped 1 meter 29 centimeters sharif jumped 1 meter 45 centimeters so who jumped the longest how far who jumped longest see 1 meter 2 meter 1 meter 1 meter 2 1 meter so ravi only jumped 2 meters so ravi jumped the longest so how far how far he jumped 2 meters 18 centimeters yes children ravi jumped the longest distance which is 2 meters 18 centimeters now how far did bindu jump over kamala where is bindu here bindu jumped 1 meter 29 centimeters okay and kamala kamala jumped 1 meter 15 centimeters who jumped more 1 meter 29 centimeters is more no so we have to find out the distance the difference so distance jumped by bindu is 1 meter 29 centimeters and the distance jumped by kamala is 1 meter 15 centimeter subtract the uh, from bindu's length distance to kamala's distance we will find out the length the distance jumped by bindu is the distance more jumped by bindu is 14 centimeters bindu jumped over kamala next question see children here how far did ravi jump over kishor kishor see kishor here kishor jumped the distance 1 meter 62 centimeters the distance jumped by ravi where is ravi ravi jumped 2 meters 18 centimeters ravi's distance to kishor distance so distance jumped by kishor is 1 meter 62 centimeters subtracting this we'll get the distance ravi jumped over over kishor is 56 centimeters children we'll see the next question who jumped longer among sharif kishor kamala and bindu arrange the, their names in ascending order considering the distance jumped so we are arranging in a ascending order uh, ascending order ascending order means smaller distance to bigger distance yes children did you remember yes kishor jumped longer than sharif kamala and bindu kishor jumped 1 meter 62 cm the order of the distance jumped by kishor kamala sharif and bindu is like this kishor is kishor jumped longer than sharif sharif jumped longer than bindu bindu jumped longer than kamala so this distance is given below rama went to a cloth shop and bought 2 meter 50 cm fabric for kurta 3 meters 25 cm fabric for pyjama what is the total length of a fabric bought by rama so two cloths she bought okay if you find out the cloths find out the total cloth we have to add see the length of cloth bought for kurta is 2 meters 50 cm the length of cloth bought for pyjama 3 meters 25 cm total cloth what we have to do total we have to add here we are adding total cloth purchased by rama is if you add this you will get 75 cm 2 plus 3 5 meters so the total cloth is 5 meters 75 cm see children can you identify this picture yes this is charmina where it is can you tell children where it is it is in hyderabad see how high is the charminar do you know if you see the 
charminar we can easily identify the charminar. So, from the long distance also we can see the charminar. See we will do a sum related to the charminar. The height of a charminar in Hyderabad is 56 meter. See the height, height of the charminar is 56 meters. The height of a school building is 14 meters. So, how many of your school buildings if placed one on top of the other will be as high as the charminar. So, the height of the charminar is 56 meters. The height of the school building is 14 meters. So, number of school buildings that make the height of the charminar. What we have to do? We have to divide. We have to divide 56 by 14. So, if you do the division, we will get the 4. Therefore, 4 school building when placed upon each other equal the charminar height. So, one upon another like that you have to put 4 school buildings. Till then, till now what we have learned? We will see once. See, we have learned identifies meter and centimeter length. We have learnt measuring length in centimeters by using scale, relates meter with centimeter, converts meter into centimeter, measures length in meters, centimeters and inches, estimate the length of an object and distance between two given locations. Solves problem involving length and distances in meters and centimeters. Evolution. See, I will give you some questions. Note down and do it at home and show to your teacher. See the questions. 4 meter ribbon is how many centimeters? 750 centimeters rope equal to how many meters and centimeters? Ramo went to the shop by 2 meters 50 centimeters of cloth for kurta and 3 meters 75 centimeters cloth for pajama. What is the total length of the cloth he bought? A textile merchant bought a 140 meters long pochampalli cotton cloth out of which 46 meter cloth was sold. What is the length of the remaining cloth? The school principal Jaya bought a ribbon of 180 meter length. She wanted to distribute 25 centimeters of ribbon to each girl. How many girls in total can she distribute the ribbon to? Children, you have to find out the length. Specify the length of the object given below. See the picture and find out the length in centimeters. Estimate and then measure the length of the objects given below using scale. Record both lengths in the table given below. You have to find out the estimated length and measure length. Here a complete piece of chalk, your pencil, your comb, your eraser, your slate, your mathematics book, your notebook. First you have to estimate the length of these. Note down this length here, then measure with scale and write down the centimeters. Children, write the name of five objects that are lesser than 2 centimeters long. Name any three objects that are about 10 centimeters tall. 1 inch is how many centimeters? Till now we learn, no? See the children, find out this length of these objects in inches. By scale you can measure and note down. Here we have given a spoon, you have to find out the length in inches. Specify the length of the object below in inches. Children, till now we learn so many things and you understand better, do practice at home. We will meet in the next class. Bye children.